Hey guys, it's me, Adam, with Unity Aquaponics. I just wanted to take a minute to give you a tour of our compost bin. We just got done doing some feeding, and I wanted to show you some of my little friends. They're red wriggler earthworms, composting worms. Uh, you can get them online. Uh, would be my recommended, uh, highly recommended advice for getting worms. Uh, Uncle Jim's Worm Farm has great red wriggler earthworms and great prices. Uh, but I just wanted to show you our feeding, some of our food. That's the bin right there, and I'm going to open that in a minute. But first, the food. Got to see what these guys eat. We take all of our non-meat food waste, as well as our neighbors. They're more than happy to give us our non their non-meat food waste, such as uh, banana peels and all sorts of peels. And we throw a little bit of citrus in, but not much. Got to be very careful with that. No meat, no eggs, no cheese. So we take... Uh, the vegan food waste and we throw in a little bit of paper we let it soak in water we blend it till it turns into this really nice just thick mash uh, it's got just enough water the worms love it so there you go there's your uh, before and after for what your food waste looks like right before you feed it to your compost worms and no that does not smell at all there is no smell to your refrigerator refrigerators keep things fresh so there's no smell and uh, my domestic partner, Maria, my fiance, if there was a smell in this bin, she would not allow it. So let me show you what's in this bin. This is where the worms are. Now you might see a little, uh, little seedlings in there, little tiny plants germinating. That's because our food waste has seeds in it. And of course, when you give them good dirt, they're just gonna germinate. So take the food, throw it in, and you gotta make sure to mix it up really well in the soil so that all the bacteria in the soil can latch onto it. Got a little thermometer right there in the corner. Keep an eye on your temperature. Ideal for worms is around 75 degrees. They love 75 degrees. Uh, below 50 degrees, you've got dead worms. So, uh, check out some of our worms. Here they are, just, mm, they're just going to town on some of the food we just gave them. You can kind of see them in there a little bit. And dig up a few more, where are they? Oh, there they are. You can see them. Anyways, they will go through their own body weight every day. They will eat their body weight in food waste. They will generate pretty much a, just as much fertilizer. And the fertilizer is really expensive and really high-grade stuff if you try and buy it. It's got a lot of nutrients in it. It's got a lot of potassium. It's got a lot of uh, nitrogen, phosphorus. It's got a lot of the elements that you really need if you want to grow food. So, this stuff is perfect, uh, no smell, easy to turn over, low maintenance, and it's the perfect place to get rid of all your aquaponic waste and all your food waste. So, check us out online, check us out on Facebook, Unity Aquaponics, uh, of course. Be sure to also check out our website, unityaquaponics.org. Don't forget to share this video and like with all your friends. Alright guys, happy growing, and I will see you next time.